Hi, welcome back to the channel. This is Lynn and I have a prophetic word for somebody today. But please remember, every prophetic word is not for everybody. If you feel that this word resonates with you or is a confirmation for you, I encourage you to still take it to the Lord in prayer. If you're not sure, pray about it and God will confirm to you in whatever way that he speaks to you. And only he can give you the full picture because we only prophesy in part and we only know in part. So what the Lord has placed on my heart to share for whoever this is for. And I believe this should probably be a confirmation of something that God has been speaking to you lately or for a while that there is a calling on your life, possibly a prophetic calling and a calling to work with children as well. So God gave me this word in a dream and what God showed me in this dream is that the person, the people that this is for had have been through a traumatic childhood experience at a very young age so between the age of maybe four or five to 11 or 12 so you've been through um you went through a traumatic experience in your childhood it could have been some form of abuse mental emotional i don't know what kind of abuse it was and because of this experience it kind of changed your personality because of the fear that it caused um, in your childhood and it changed your personality and you became a harsh person and quick to anger but this is not your true identity this is something that you have been maybe for a long time but it is because of that experience that um, you changed into this kind of personality kind of to protect yourself from being hurt by people possibly so god wants to heal you from that hurt and restore your true identity in christ who you were who he made you to be before this incident that changed you your character and the reason that God is dealing with this issue and bringing it to the light now is because of this calling, this prophetic calling and this calling to work with children, probably who have been through the same kind of experiences. And because of your experience, um, God is calling you to be able to help um, these kind of children, to teach them about the love of God, to bring healing to them. But before you walk into this new calling, you have to heal your past hurts and find your original identity in Christ. So the verses that the Lord um, led me to share today, the first is 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 17. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. All things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. So now that you are in Christ, that experience has passed away. It's, it's gone. It's in the past. And you don't have to be fearful. You don't have to try and be harsh as a form of protecting yourself anymore. And you will no longer be quick to anger because that is not who you are um, you are taking on your new identity in Christ and this is originally who you were before all this happened a very happy person I saw in the dream and that is your true identity so another verse is Romans 8 28 it says and we know that all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are the called according to his purpose. So as much as this experience was very traumatic and has been weighing on you, 
whether you were not even conscious that that is why you were like this and it's been weighing on you but all things are working for good at this time because God is turning that experience into a positive thing for you to be able to work with children who have been through that kind of trauma and you will be the perfect person for this because of that experience so when the bible says all things it's not just good things it's even bad experiences that god works out for good and that is what is happening so he has called you and according to his purpose and your experience will be used for god's purposes to help others so the last verse that i have is ephesians 2 verse 10 for we are his workmanship created in christ jesus for good works which god prepared beforehand that we should walk in them so you are going to bring hope and healing to those who have been through similar experiences and yeah god is using that experience for you to be a blessing to other people so that is what i have today it's not a long word and i pray that it is a confirmation for those that it is for thank you to the new subscribers i remind you that this is a bilingual channel so whatever i post in french i have already posted in english and if you do not know jesus this is the time to get to know jesus he's bringing restoration as you can see through this message and healing and he has a purpose and a plan for each and every one of us no matter what you've been through he gives you a new identity when you are walking with him all you have to do is accept him in your heart repent and ask for forgiveness for your sins ask him to come into your life fill you with the holy spirit and it's as simple as that and you become a part of the children of god I encourage you to pray to stay in worship to buy a bible and read the references and to continue reading the word every day because it is um, one of the most important ways that god speaks to us and gives us guidance for our everyday lives so thanks for listening and i'll see you back in the channel soon be blessed bye